Mike, 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 Mike. No edits in the trenches. I don't want to edit. We are live from the trenches. Mike, 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 Mike. First of all, shout out to every single one of y'all that watch this content, whether religiously or in passing. Shout out to Easy the Black Captain, the trenches too. Card is being developed. A couple battles have been announced. Reed Dollars vs. Oom P. Hollow Man vs. Ice. And now, Mike P versus Rosenberg Roy. Now, I'll take you back a little bit. So, there are some people, older heads like myself, uh, we respect this car. We respect the Hollow Mans of the world. Coming back, we haven't seen him in years and years on top of years. If you're from this area or if you know about that level of battle rap, salute to him. Uh, we got uh, Reed Dollars on another battle. And then you got Oom P coming back too. And now you got Frozenberg versus Mike P. Mike! Don't get, don't get me started. I spoke to you on Twitter this morning. I said, and I quote, this battle better happen. You know what I'm saying? I'll tell you the exact tweet that I said. You know what I'm saying? Let's, let's, let's go from my own tweets. I said that uh, this card is fire. You know what I'm saying? First and foremost. And that Mike P versus Frozenberg better happen. We ain't got time for no bullshit or no politics. I don't want to hear about no lucrative offer. I don't want to hear about you getting called with loaded lux and, and, and murder mook on the card, wanting to battle you two on one on URL. You made your decision now. You are over here. You are on the New York side. I chose my side. I'm riding with New York. SP has to pick everyone from Philadelphia. I don't care who they are. They represent the city. I am a representative. I'm from New York. I represent New York. And that's the side that I'm on. I haven't even seen the whole card. I don't even care. I mean, well, I have kind of so. And there's a do, 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 do. But it don't matter. It don't even matter who they pick from New York. I am with New York. Ain't, there ain't no changing that. New York 5-0. Or however many battles there's on the motherfucking card. 6-0, 3-0, 4-0. I don't care. I am with New York. I got a lot of love for Philadelphia. Everybody knows that. I represent Philadelphia a lot. I'm in Philly every day. Once I finish this blog, I'm about to go to Philadelphia. I got a lot of love for the city. But when it comes to Philadelphia versus New York, I'm with New York. And we ain't going to bias whatever the case may be. You know what I mean? In this scenario. Now, in other battles, you know, if they put... A big dude from somebody that's got a lot of talent that could win easy versus somebody that's from New York who ain't really that good. Of course, I'm going to pick based off the battles. But in this scenario, this scheme, Philly versus New York, I'm going with New York. Period. All right, so Mike P. Um, Mike P feels like he's top tier. He hasn't got a lot of battles that he feels like he deserves. He feels like his catalog, his resume basically on URL is not where he wanted it to be. And I heard a lot of the top tier chatter. I heard how he feels. I heard what he thinks, but top tiers do what they want. This is a good start. Doing what you want without getting called, without being told, oh, you can't come back over here. Oh, we, we, but, uh, but, uh, but, uh, we was looking to throw you on the next eight app events, and we had uh, the this nigga on the app for you, and okay, nobody's going to see it. I get it. No, you're not going to be on Summer Madness. No, you're not going to be on Gnome. No, you're not going to be on the Drake card. Who knows if Drake's coming back? I don't fucking know. But you ain't going to be on none of them cards, but you're going to be on every app event. I'm glad that you're taking your career in your own hands. Take your career in your own hands. If you cook and they book, and I keep saying this, the talent rules everything. Talent trumps everything. This is not a URL hate blog. I just talked about Summer Madness. I got uh, what's happening in Battle Rap this week. Hope Summer Madness goes well. You know what I'm saying? If you cook and they book it, we're going to watch it anyway. I keep saying that. People are encouraging us to just go tear it down, burn it down. I'm not with that. I'm like, okay, you know, I want to see Rock versus Av and a lot of other battles on there I'm going to watch. But with Mike P, uh, this is a big move. So you're battling in Philly versus New York. It's going down, you know what I'm saying, in Philadelphia, uh, September 9th. 1621 Cecil B. Moore in North Philly. Uh, should be lit. Should be lit. Gutter City presents the trenches. Uh, you got Rosenberg Raw. Uh, Rosenberg Raw is nice, you know what I'm saying? He gets a lot of love in the city. I did see his battle versus Steel that was like outside. He cooked you. I ain't gonna lie, he gotta cook you. He gotta... See, with Philly, the streets, the streets. See, you got the leagues. And you got the environments where it's like, you know, a battle rap area, a battle rap league, and then you got the streets. Like that battle, when they took them battles to the streets and they was battling in the park, that's the era that I'm from. 
the heckling, the talking through your rounds, the, 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 you didn't want to bet that? Nigga, let's make that bet right now, motherfucker. I'm from that, you know what I'm saying? Like, I remember those days where crews and entourage be damn near about to get into a fight over the bets and money on the floor, and I got 5,000 on my man, he won't win the next round, and blah, 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 blah. I love that shit. Not gonna lie, that's my shit. Um, good to see Easy making himself back in the news with this card. Nostalgia, you got uh, Philly versus New York. I hate the way nostalgia is spelled. It's nasty, GLA, I, I, I hate it, I'm not gonna lie. I do hate it, but I don't hate the card. I hate. I like the concept, I don't hate the card, I hate the name. But it's nostalgia, it's bringing it back to the essence where they went and got some of the older cats, like the Head Ice, like uh, Hollow Man, like Reed Dollars, like Oom P. Uh, if they get Rex, or shine. This would be this would be a great this would be a great 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 card to see K Shine make a comeback on or Rex. You know what I'm saying? We haven't seen Rex in a little while, but you can't. You're doing Philly versus New York. They got some Philly versus New York matchups, but you that that joint to push it over the top. Like you need that NH versus Shine, or you know you need that rematch with Rex. Like you need something like that. Like that that. That is going to really stamp it. It's already fire and I'm going to watch it anyway. But you need that nail in the coffin. I don't think Easy's, Easy probably will not be on this card because he's got a disaster coming up. So I don't think he's going to be on this. And if he was, I probably would have known. But hey, I, I can never be too surprised nowadays. So I don't know. He may or he may not, but I didn't ask. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I like Mike P versus Rosenberg Raw. Mike P, the first way to become a top tier is to make moves unapologetically and do what the fuck you need to do for your career. That's first and foremost. Top tier MCs like a Goods, like a Calico, like a Clips, like a like like these dudes, DNA and all them cats. They could go wherever they want. They could battle wherever they want. They have to worry about nobody calling them, telling them to get off the car, and yada yada yada. All this whole shit that goes on behind the scene. You don't have to worry about none of that. Just do as you please. Now, if that's the case. You told me it's a thousand, thousand percent sure. You know how much a thousand percent is? Mike, do you know how much a thousand percent is? You know that like you know your kids' names. I don't know Mike P to back out from anything except for the driveway to get ready to leave, so yeah, I, don't, I don't envision it, but I had to ask early. And that's what I'm gonna do from now on. Whenever it comes to somebody that's associated or affiliated or could be called, or, you know, I'm going to tweet that shit out early. Is this battle happening? We don't got time for no bullshit politics. I don't want to do this no more. I'm sorry. Like, that's just me. I don't I don't care about the league on league. Or you can't go over there. We don't like him. We ain't going to book you or put you on nothing that you want. We ain't giving you no big names. We ain't giving you no no cards. But you can't go over there and battle either. Nigga, what the fuck? See, that's the thing. Y'all got to stop the dumb shit. Get money. I keep telling these artists. Get fucking money. Get to the bag. If you cook and they book it, it's 100 leagues out here. I'm about to start saying some of y'all, some other niggas' names that need to be outside that we need to see. They not booking you. They've already surpassed a lot of you niggas' whole class. We just watched in one year, Sir Soul got, and there's no knock on him, salute to him and everything that he's got. He just came off of a Danny battle. He already had Rum Nitty. Uh, these niggas is getting battles. They was in the two on two, and this is just one MC out of all of the new ones. Hey, Ryder, hey, the rest of y'all, y'all don't get these calls when they calling you for Rum Nitty, when they calling y'all niggas for Charlie Clips, when they calling y'all, they not calling y'all. So what are you doing? Y'all niggas is just sitting on the bench and you watching niggas that came from college, got drafted, and are getting better opportunities than you. Couldn't be me. I'll let y'all have it. And that's not just one. It's a bunch of them over there just sitting on the bench hoping to get a call for an app event. <laughs> Shout out to fucking Mike B. Take your career in your own hands. There is no reason why bloggers should be making more money than some of these mid-tier battlers. Why? Because they're not getting booked. Niggas is just giving you excuses, feeding you rhetoric. Your career. Nigga, you're gonna sit on the shelf for another year and another year. Some of y'all been out since 2017, dog. I remember some of y'all niggas came in 2017. Y'all are still not on volumes, not on gnomes, not on summer madnesses. Not on caffeine, not getting no good names, can't call him and tell him I want to battle clips or I want to battle goods and get the fucking battle. What are you niggas doing? Your niggas' careers is like hamsters in a treadmill. Y'all going nowhere. Y'all just going insane. It's like a hamster wheel with a lot of y'all careers. While other people are coming out of nowhere and just getting on, boom, they out of here. Boom, 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 they out of here. And some of them don't even be stars. <laughs> it's just be favorites, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to Mike P. Taking your career into your own hands. I see a lot of good things for you out there. Fuck that. 
If you ain't, if you cooking, they booking. You nice like that, we gonna see you anyway. That's the only way. You can't tell us where you are. You have to show us where you are. Telling me where you're at, telling me your career, telling me, that doesn't mean shit because you ain't getting booked versus no top names, period. They not doing it. It is what it is. It could have been happened. It could have been happened. But they booking you against new niggas, against people in the middle, and woo 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 Man, fuck that. You want to get paid? You want to get paid? Go find that man, B. Go find that man, and don't come back until you find that man. I respect this move. Battle, get your money. You got family to feed, right? You got kids, you got wife, you got family to feed, huh? You sitting around waiting for the next motherfucker. You wait for him if you want. You're going to be waiting all summer. I bet you I got paid this summer. I bet you I got paid this summer. And some of your artists need to feel the same way. The fuck you doing sitting on the bench for? Huh? 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 Can you call niggas when your rent is due? Can you call niggas when your lights is about to go out? Can you call niggas and say, yo, you just heard nothing and say, I, did, 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 did. I had my grandmother, I had to watch her pass. I couldn't call you for a battle, which made it worse. Hmm? 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 Huh? You niggas can't even call and get a battle? All right. I'm going to leave it there. Shout out to the trenches. Shout out. Mike P came home. He riding with New York. He over here. He on this side. Philly, get over there. I, I'm biased. He's on our side. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Froze, you my man too, but I'm, I'm with New York. You know what I'm saying? Is what, I'm with New York. Period. You know what I mean? Shout out to the Big Apple. Shout out to everybody in the city. Mike B is from Long Island. I hear people saying, oh, this is not specifically Philly versus New York. Listen, if a nigga from PA and somebody from New York, that's Philly. Bro. I don't care about he's from this part or he's from Allentown. I don't care. We don't care. We just want to see the fucking battles, yo. We just want to see good battles. That's why I tweeted that shit out early. Mike P versus Rosenberg, this is fire and better happen. We ain't got shine for no politics. We don't give a fuck about no politics. We don't give a damn about no, oh, you can't go over here, you can't go over here. Man, nobody cares about that shit. We don't care. I'm telling you right now, we don't care. We don't give a fuck. I don't want to hear about no battles getting back. I don't want to hear about no lucrative offers. I don't want to hear about no fucking deal. Because the niggas who just backed off of Easy to Block Captain's last card, didn't none of them niggas get on summer. Didn't none of them niggas get on Summer Madness? Every one of them. All five, however many of it was, them niggas did not get on Summer Madness. Period. True Folk got an ace I mean battle that was horrible. He lost every fucking round and got his ass kicked across the street. Uh, Danny Myers went up there and had to battle with Miss Hustle, had a bad two on two, and he had to go beat a nigga in the street in order to get his respect. So it doesn't not even it doesn't even make sense to do it. Trenches two, we'll see you soon, Mike P. Gang, 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 I don't bang. I'm out. Stop holding y'all career for niggas who don't give a fuck about you is the end of the story. One.